up y'all it's your girl bread welcome back to the bread and brandon channel so today i am going to be addressing some questions from the vapor rub video so i just came up with this idea to do this video because i keep getting my notifications blew up and i'm very grateful i'm very thankful let's start there thank you guys for 50k on the vapor rub video i'm so grateful oh I got my cookies here because I'm hungry and y'all, I just ain't been like, y'all put in the comments with y'all go away to this. If you, I've been getting various comments about um uh, different things on the Vapor Rub video. So I decided to just go ahead on and do this video to address some of those things. Let's start off with, <clears throat> let me pull up the video. All right, so there was some questions about does it work on your arms? Put it like that. All right, so the whole point of this, doing this was to get rid of, the vapor rub was to get was to get rid of some fat overnight. So if you want, put it like that, you can try this on whatever part of your body you want to. Because you guys asked me about that, I'm thinking about doing it, even though I don't really, you guys, I got fat, but it's not that much. So we could do it. Um, and then someone asked, someone told me to talk about uh, how does it work help with water retention. Let me just be honest with you guys. Then there was some questions about did I lose any pounds from doing it. Now I didn't lose any pounds from doing it. Let's just start there. It was one day and. It was just for the stomach area and there wasn't no exercise and I still ate what I wanted to eat. That's probably why I didn't lose any pounds. Let's start there. It burned weight and it burned fat off of my stomach. It wasn't a lot. This also answers the question um, about can you do it again and again. Yes, you can. And I got another video to do something simple. You know, doesn't require all of those materials and something else to help with losing stomach fat because that's my my go-to right now is losing upper body fat put it like that you know uh let me see someone asked could i use a waist trimmer instead of the plastic wrap my mother told me that she wasn't going to be able to do this challenge or i guess i'm i keep saying challenge y'all but she wasn't going to be able to do this because the plastic wrap she's allergic to the plastic wrap so I understand for the people that didn't go through with this and didn't like that. So look, when you're allergic to things like that, you know the stuff, do use something else. So if you couldn't use a plastic wrap, do the waist trainer or something that's going to, you can wrap around or something that's going to hold your stomach in, something that you're not allergic to, but use the vapor rub if you want to do this exact thing. Uh, so since they asked, could I use a waist trimmer instead of the plastic wrap? Yeah. Uh, um, all right, let's scroll. Let's see some more. Someone said, and people have been coming under her uh, comment. Her name is Jay Jim. It was funny what she was saying. She said she's going to try with coconut oil. Now. That's not really a question. She wasn't asking a question, but I'm just gonna address it. I haven't done it with coconut oil. I do have some coconut oil. I haven't done it with coconut oil. But she just gave me an idea, so I may try it with coconut oil. All right. Let's see. Um, someone says my stomach looks the same. Now, I don't even know if I should address that. That's not rude or anything. That's just how they feel. But clearly, the whole point of the thumbnail was to show you guys the results. If my the whole point of the video was to show you guys my results. So when you see now, when you look at the thumbnail, you could see how I was growing a roll on the side, and you could see how the roll decreased in the the picture to the side. So that's all I can say about that day. It did work. It didn't burn as much off my stomach, but it did. That's why you should just keep doing it. Keep going at it. If you want to see major results, keep going at it. Um, 
So yeah, it did, it worked. It did, my stomach did look different. How many times did I wrap my stomach with the wrap? The serene wrap. So look, uh, I wasn't counting. I wasn't counting, but I've been answering questions about that. I would say, just wrap it, make sure that it's tight enough, you know? You don't want it to be loose, cause it's gonna be loose and I'm, like the next day when you wake up or like later when you do when, whenever how, if you do it throughout the day it's gonna loosen up however that goes uh but i would say wrap it at least i told a person 10 times but i would say wrap it at least six or more times but depending on how you wrap you may be an expert at it you may know how to wrap real good so you may not even have to wrap that many times um so just wrap it so that you will feel like when your stomach is, you know, tight, like it's wrapped up good enough. But don't do it too tight. You don't need, you need, you need to be comfortable while you're sleeping. You don't need to be uncomfortable. So just do it tight enough. Um, someone asked, where did I get my waist trainer? If you would have read the uh, description, I was telling you guys that we were testing, um, I was basically testing out the uh, waist trainers, but I said that you guys can order them through us. We have a business called Luxury Creations and Extensions. Instagram is Luxury Everything underscore underscore. Any inquiries, you can email us, DM us. I'm always on our social media, so respond and whatever. I respond. Um, did you say you use a whole jar just enough to cover your area you wanted? Smaller. I did not use the whole jar. I was specifying about the VIX. The VIX vape rub is a small tube. That's what they selling at the stores now. It's small. But you, if you remember, if you recall when you were younger and coming up, the tubes used to look too, the small. The, the tube used to look just like the off brand vape rub. So I was saying that you don't have to use VIX. You can use the off brand VIX vape rub. And I was saying that. If I had have used the little small tubes that everyone was selling, Walmart didn't even have, you know, a taller, didn't even have Vicks Vapor Rub. So I was, was like surprised. Uh, but if you use that small tube, I was saying you probably would end up using either half of the tube or most of it. Like you probably would only do it, use it once or twice if to do this. Cause it's so small. So I would say I uh that's why I bought the off brand kind. So I didn't use Vix people to address it. I did not use Vix Zaver rub. I used chest rub. Family Dollar brand because I got it from Family Dollar. But I'm pretty sure Fred sell they brand. Dollar Jenner may even have a brand. Um, and it was a person from Nigeria that asked, um, where do they purchase the vape rub? I'm so sorry I cannot answer that question. I've never been to Nigeria. I don't know anything about Nigeria. But what I should have done was at least research to see where you guys can um purchase that from. But someone commented. So if you haven't been back, I hope you go back and check that out. Someone commented to tell you what kind and I guess where you can get it from. Someone said, how do you stop the itch? So right there let's go back to that question about my mama said that she was allergic to the plastic wrap so she won't be using it uh you allergic to something so you may need to take something out i don't know if you're allergic to the plastic wrap or the vapor rub or if you use a waist trainer or whatever you're allergic to something so you you need to eliminate something so does this help to lose a bit of weight or to look unbloated? Both. Period. Pooh. <laughs> Both. It helps to look unbloated, lose weight. Girl, if your stomach is getting flat, you ain't looking bloated. You ain't looking fat. It's flatter. So whatever you was in that stomach caused it to be that big, you losing that by doing this. So yes, it works. It's a quick fix. Someone say, does it last or does the belly come back? Let me just tell this, and this is the last question. Um, oh, well, I can answer a couple more. Okay. Uh, the whole point of losing weight, losing fat, um, 
and etc and etc dieting that if you stop doing you can start that and you do good if you stop doing it and go back to doing wrong most likely you will gain that back so i'm just gonna be honest you have to keep up everything that you do you have to be able to balance if you just want your weight to remain the same you have to be able to balance so either way it go you can eat a lot you're gonna gain a lot uh depending on what you eat you can lose you can lose you can keep it off if you keep doing right you just have to do the right thing you have to figure out what it is that you're supposed to be doing what you're supposed to be eating and that's another video i'm gonna help y'all so yes all of it can last it just depends on if you keep it up if you do right so yeah but it's not going to last if you turn right back around you don't do it anymore you sit around you don't exercise you just eat you just doing bad just doing wrong so it's not gonna work if you're doing wrong okay so um i'm gonna answer two more questions and then that's it um how did wearing it throughout the day work for you as i mentioned i did not wear it throughout the day i wore it overnight uh i suggest that if you wear it throughout the day um that you should start you're going to be doing it for at least 10 or more hours so if you're an early bird you may want to do it early in the morning and not take it out till late at night however they go whatever works for you but I'm pretty sure you'll do the same thing that it did overnight. It just was better for overnight because I know that I was going to be sleep for a long time. But throughout the day, like, you know, I have to get into the, whatever, going places. So, or you can do it for however long you want to do it. Um, It's up to you. Okay. Let's answer one more question. Thanks for all the compliments. That's all I see. Compliments, compliments. Thank you guys. Um, I just want to say good luck to everyone. Um, I hope that I help you guys in this video. Any more comments, any more questions, put them in the comments. Thanks for 50k on the Vapor Rub video. 50 plus k. Thank you guys for over 1K subscribers. Almost at 2K, one for 2K, one for 10K. <laughs> Thank you guys. And um, let me know how it all goes. Um, let me know what you thought was wrong. Let me know if you have any concerns. And I'll be here to help. Bye.